Hello everyone, it's Adisha from Learn with Adisha. Now, if you want something new, I've got just the thing. Now, if you want to learn grammar, I can teach. I could teach you grammar, and that's exactly what I'm gonna do in this video. So also, don't forget to like and subscribe, and hit the bell button when you subscribe to get notified for all our new videos. So now, are you wondering what articles are? They're the words A and N. If you thought A was a vowel le and letter, you're absolutely wrong. It is a vowel and letter, but it's also a word. So now that you got the details and what's special about the letter A is that it's a word. Now, let's go to a science topic. Magnetism. If you've ever played with magnets, you'd see that the north pole of one magnet repels the north pole of another magnet. And the north pole of one magnet attracts the south pole of another magnet. It's the same. Like poles don't want. Unlike poles want each other. So now what does that got to do with grammar? Now the answer is that grammar is almost like it. Well, grammar articles. So articles are a little uh, complex, but today we're going to cover them in a span of time. And after this video, you'll have a revision test so you can remember it for every day after this one. So now the word A is used with words that have a consonant, not the vowels letters other simply letters other than a e i o and u u including y sometimes not the not the other letters like the other letters such as b c d f g h k l m n o p the p q o is a vowel so now that you understood the concept of vowels and goes with the letter with words starting with vowels such as an apple an elephant an iguana so can you just try to fix this problem that i'm going to show you it's going to be a revision test. So anyways, now, can you say elephant? Plus what? Is it A or N? If you said N, you're correct. Now, what about the word duck? Is it A or N? The answer is A. Now, here's a harder one. Submarine. Now, what do we need to add to make it grammatically correct? Submarine plus what? Can you think for yourself? Okay, if you haven't got the answer, the answer is A. So now that you've got the basics of grammar, this is me out. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share this video. Don't forget also to, also, after you've subscribed, don't forget to press the bell button so you'll be notified when our next video comes out. Goodbye, everyone, and hope you have a happy day.